morning, Vikings. I'm the student who is feeling the spring weather, Chanel Williams. And I'm the student who complains about the temperature no matter what the temperature is, Joanne Members. Today is Tuesday, April 28th, 2020. Who's ready for lunch? Pre-packaged meals, breakfast, lunch, and dinner will be distributed on Mondays and Wednesdays only. The meals will be distributed from the parking lot of 14 district schools and two apartment complexes. Today will be sunny with a high of 73. That's right! Well, almost. It is pretty much a perfect day. It's going to rain. I can't wait to find something to whine about. Let's go to sports! Harshman Vikings, hope you're all out enjoying the sunshine. Hey, Jacob and I wanted to remind you, eighth graders, don't forget, fill out those 21st Century Scholar applications. You have until June 30th. This is how you can apply. Good morning, Harshman Vikings. This is Miss Bernudo, the social worker. Today, Tuesday, April the 28th, the Indianapolis Urban League is having a food distribution event at their center, which is at 777 Indiana Avenue. This is on the west side of downtown, just off the corner of Indiana Avenue and Blackford Street, very close to IUPUI campus and just a couple of blocks from the canal. The event starts at 11 a.m. today, so feel free to drive through and pick up what your family needs. Have a great day, Vikings. Hello, oh, Harshman Team IU. It's me, Michelle, and you know what time it is? Trivia Tuesday. I am dressed as two essential employees right now, a construction worker and a garbage man or woman. Team IU, here's your challenge. Can you name five other essential jobs? Essential workers in this time of quarantine. So we have a nurse, my sister Jennifer, who work, is a nurse, at the University of Cincinnati. I'm thinking doctors, nurses. Obviously, first responders and nurses are a huge help during this time right now. Special shout out to my brother-in-law, Dave. He is a paramedic. And then we have uh, farm workers who are picking our food. Um, another, other essential workers would be um, bus drivers. Appreciate our post office workers. The mail carriers who bring us all those good letters every day. Delivery specialist. Through rain and sleet and snow and pandemics, we appreciate you. Uh, we have uh, police officers. Police officers, obviously, and EMT. I think those fall under first responders, firefighters, um, doctors have the emergency room personnel at the hospital who took care of my husband last week. We also have morticians. Um, we have the vet who took care of my sick puppy. I want to shout out all of the essential workers um, who work in housekeeping. Um, hospital custodial staff. Like my mother-in-law, Tina. Uh, who works at a residential facility for terminally ill children. So shout out to her. Grocery workers, people who work in grocery stores. The grocery store clerks. People like my son, Mike, who works for Kroger's. Uh, employees that are restocking the grocery shelves that are doing a good job of making sure everybody has food. And we have uh, a construction workers like my nephew Adam. I believe that's five. Yeah. All of those are people are essential for us to stay safe, stay healthy. So thank you so much for those essential workers. Thank you. I want to thank anyone who has family members that are one of these people. Grocery employees, healthcare workers, auto mechanics, emergency like fire, police, EMT, and 
of course, I had to throw in construction workers. Have a great day, Vikings, and have a terrific Tuesday. Guys, haven't the teachers been doing a great job on the announcements? You will never be as good as yeah, this. Yeah, don't you're not gonna try to replace them. That's the news for now. Make it a timely. Terrific. Tuesday, Vikings. <laughs> oh, hey, Harshman Vikings. It's time for some Trivia Tuesday. Yes, but don't get any ideas. No costumes. Mm. And that is all. Missing you.